Hello, good day, and welcome again to another uh, episode of uh, Maritime Aviators Blog. This is me, Snail. So I'm going to take you on a tour on our steering gear room. Now I apologize if my video right now I'm doing is a bit shaky because um, yeah I, I have to uh, uh, you know take this video. So here we go. We're going on a tour. So, uh, from the moment, uh, here is the quick look on our steering gear room. Basically, the steering gear room is located on the aft part of the ship. And uh, this is our uh, telephone, uh, telephone boot we used for uh, emergency steering drills or emergency steering situation. So, this is our telephone. Um, as you can see, there are two types of telephone that we used, and we used a head headset in order to communicate from the bridge. And uh, yeah, now uh, here is usually the motors used in terms of anchoring. We do have a separate hydraulic motor for the uh, winches in the aft area. Um, this is also uh, the switch boxes for our emergency steering. So here is the motor we used for, uh, for our emergency steering. As you can see, this is the motor for number two. Um, basically in operating this, it's more like a switch box. You just tilt it to the left to put it on port and you tilt it to the right uh, to put it on the starboard side. Now here is the manual weather indicator. It back on the bridge it used to be digital, but here it's just um, it's just basically a metric tape with an indications uh, or indications on uh, uh, how much degree is to be uh, you know twisted. Now here is also our storage of our mooring ropes, specifically our loose ropes. We also have some uh, other items here that we uh, store and uh, this is the lubricating tags but I don't really know much about this because that's the engine room. Now this is our mooring wires, we also store spare mooring wires here along with our, uh, 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 what do you call this, uh, our guards, rat guards. Uh, this is our baby fenders, and this is our mandal uh, spare ones, the new ones. Um, okay, uh, yeah, this is our uh, lots of drums, uh, lubricating drums uh, used by the engine. Also, uh, just to add, uh, we also store here lubricating oils for our ship, like uh, wire grease, uh, machine grease, uh, as pictured here, you can see. We even have a protective uh, equipment how to handle this, uh, you know, these uh, chemicals. So there, uh, I guess let's proceed to the next. Uh, also some uh, oil drums. Uh, I don't know what's inside of this cabinet, but I think the engine room knows uh, some ideas. It's a very compressor parts probably. Come Okay, uh, this is the equipment used uh, mostly by engine. They, uh, you know, so store some stuff here, like this instance, the portable ventilation fan. Um, yeah, uh, some, uh, you know, sticks we use for the mops. We also have this uh, free, uh, you know, tanks. I'm not familiar with this one, to be honest. Uh, I think the engine uh, department really knows about this one. And another storage cabinet for our uh, grease, for motor grease. Um, yeah. And this is also, uh, we store the, uh, our gear grease here. So, okay, let's move on to the next. Uh, this is, uh, oh, oh yeah, by the way, uh, our steering gear is also used as a makeshift uh, citadel in case of pirate attack. So we can see the portable toilet here, some uh, mineral waters, some biscuits, crackers, uh, that's about it. That's the only thing stored here. So just in case of a pirate attack, uh, we just definitely run our, uh, we run and here on our steering gear room. And, uh, 
Yeah, we uh, that's the stuff we need for preparation in case of a pirate attack. Now this is, I'm not familiar with this one, um, Engine Room as well knows this, but uh, since I'm on the tech department I have no idea. Uh, all I know is that this is a UV sterilizer machine of some sort, probably uh, a motor to, I don't know, disinfect maybe, the water. So, uh, yeah, okay, um, let's move on to the next. Okay, so uh, this is the hydro foil pump. I'm not familiar with that as well. Oh, yeah, I forgot one more thing uh, just to tell you. This is also another spot where we hide our uh, firefighting equipment. So, as you can see, this red cabinet this is where we store our fireman's outfit. Inside of this cabinet, have two fireman's outfits. So there goes the cylinder tank along with the uh, gloves, boots. Um, okay, this is another uh, storage area. As you can see, we even have our uh, rope there and uh, extra spare cylinders. So yeah, I guess that's bad. We better lock that. Okay. Um, there we go. I guess that is the quick tour of our uh, steering gear, I better head outside. Um, that's the ventilation area. Uh, we receive fresh air from, I don't know, from what, where it's located. Also, I just like to add, this is also an emergency exit for the engine. I'm not gonna pursue that, uh, which way it leads down, so I'll better leave, uh, leave that up. Also, uh, we also have the water mist local pump starter, which uh, this is used as for uh, some sort of device, as firefighting device. So yeah, we also have by the way a fire extinguisher, and as you can see on this door, we perfectly have a metal door here for uh, piracy. Um, as you can see, we have already have a welded door here, which basically blocks this wooden door so that uh, no other, uh, in case the pirates got access to the engine room, they couldn't access the steering gear room. So yeah, I think that's about it. That is the whole tour of our steering gear uh, session. So I have to go up now. And for those who are watching this, thank you a lot for watching. I hope to see you soon again on my next video. And until next time, have a great day. And bye-bye. Uh,